he's done an amazing job this year with his team. And uh, my hat's off to him for the way that he's he's coached that team and the way he's put that together. And, uh, you know, if, if I had the luxury and I had the time, I'd be very happy for him. But unfortunately, I don't. Dave, could you have imagined that last summer when you were talking to Steve Kerr that you guys would be facing each other now in the finals? Yeah, that's a great, that's, you know, that's a great uh, irony and, 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 and story. Uh, the, the way that I, I look at it is, uh, especially when I think back to our conversation, is that we both got exactly what we wanted. We wanted to be a part of a successful team that could compete for the championship of the NBA. And it's happened. Only we're on different sides. We're on different sides. Where did your relation? Where did your relationship with him start? How far do you guys go back? Um, where did it start? You know, I got to think about that. I'm, I'm, I'm forgetting just for a moment. But uh, I've known of Steve for for many, many years, and, and we, we we have a connection, and and. Uh, uh, we share the same agent, who's Mark Bardestein and Priority Sports, and that's kind of a family organization, so we were uh, partially connected through that, but I knew Steve beforehand. In the last two series, it was fairly clear-cut what LeBron would see, you know, Butler or Carroll with some help. What do you think the Warriors will do on him and, and does it matter in terms of how where you start LeBron on the floor like in the offensive flow? I'm sure they'll show diff they'll throw different looks at him uh, and uh, you know how exactly they're going to guard him I, maybe I'll call my friend Steve Kerr and I'll ask him <laughs> see 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 how good friends we really are <laughs> when, when, you, when you made the decision to come here did you